Hello, you're on Extreme TV, and we're in uh, Monte Carlo at the Rendezvous de Saint Ambre, which is a very important event in the reinsurance industry. Near me are the representatives or, uh, of uh, Certasig, a very important Romanian company, which uh, we would like to talk with them uh, regarding the reinsurance tendencies and, uh, of course, uh, the Certasig's plans on uh, the Romanian market. So, because we're at a very important meeting regarding the reinsurance industry, yes. what would be the, the tendencies you've seen so far on this market? Will the prices increase? Uh, what about the capacity? Well, I think one of the main themes we've heard uh, discussed is the Japanese earthquakes and the New Zealand earthquakes and a number of catastrophes which hit the first half of the, the year in 2011 and many reinsurers worldwide have been affected. Um, what does this mean for Romania and Chetasig and our market is that, uh, generally speaking, reinsurers will want to increase premiums. But I think in Romania, where we haven't been affected, fortunately, by any uh, large disasters in the last five, ten years, um, we'll be able to justify either reductions or, or similar premiums to those that we paid last year for reinsurance. Certainly that's our goal at Chetasig, not to spend more money on reinsurance, but of course to choose reinsurers that are supportive and, and financially stable. Um, some of the reinsurers we work with, obviously we will have to uh, be very uh, attentive to see how they've paid their losses on other, on other mm -hmm. claims um, that haven't affected Romania. And th for us it's an exciting time. The company is growing, so reinsurance will, will, will increase in terms of limits that we buy, uh, more capacity so we can write bigger risks and more of them. What about the prices? Uh, do you think you're going to pay more for reinsurance in terms of, uh, in terms of prices? I think for catastrophe we will pay roughly the same. Um, I think for the per risk and liability maybe a little bit more. Um, so generally I think nothing, nothing dramatically, nothing dramatically different to last year or 2011. Because you told us a couple of things regarding the, the catastrophes in New Zealand or, or Japan, how much do you think uh, they can influence the prices and the capacity in our region? for example, in Central and Eastern Europe? Well, I would argue, and Mihaila would argue, that it shouldn't affect us at all, but <laughs> because these catastrophes are in other markets where you know, we're not involved. We're focused on domestic Romanian business. Um, yes, it is earthquake exposed, and yes, we do have floods in Romania. Um, but so far, those claims have not been huge. We haven't had any earthquakes, as you know, and the floods have been fairly isolated, individual uh, local areas, so nothing, nothing huge. Um, so I think it would be difficult for reinsurers to try and uh, justify big increases for the Romanian market based on Japanese losses or New Zealand earthquakes. Now if you were to talk about uh, your company, which, uh, what, what plans do you have for, for the future? And if you can comment on, uh, let's say, the situation in, of the company in 2011. So in 2011 we made a lot of progress as uh, everybody was able to see. Uh, 2010 was a year of uh, changes, but 2011 started to be a year of uh, development. We develop our uh, portfolio. We are now, now uh, in the market as uh, being uh, an insurer, corporate insurer, focused on uh, type of lines of business such as liability, property, bonds, and engineering, we will still offer to our clients and uh, collaborators um, some kind of uh, new products, fully adapted uh, to the client's needs, tailor-made, so we are uh, working and want to develop this to be able to meet the, the client's needs. So all what we offer is tailor-made. And this will be our strategy from now on, even the next year. As far as I know, a big part of your, your portfolio, though, though I don't know the percentage exactly, is uh, marine business. Could you comment on uh, uh, the perspectives of, of this class, this segment? This segment is developing, so we write uh, marine business both in Romania and Turkey. Uh, it's good for us because we are uh, known in the market, in the eastern uh, part. And uh, yes, we'll develop this. Marine will still be an important part of our business. Actually, it's about 45% of our business.
45 and the rest the rest of the classes account for the rest the rest of the classes are liability bonds engineering property actually we have a small part of aviation which we will uh, carry on developing what uh, in the in the top of the the insurance companies on the Romanian market do you have like a, a specific place you want to get to I think because of our clear and specific strategy on motor business and as you know very well the motor business dominates the market at 75% of the premium we will never really be in the top 10 insurance companies so if we could be between 10 and 15 with